Hello all. In this session, we'll discuss topic 12 of unit 4, which is Web Analytics Maturity Model and Web Analytics Tools. So first, let us discuss Web Analytics Maturity Model. So what is Web Analytics Maturity Model? It is a framework that helps organizations evaluate their level of expertise in using Web Analytics. It outlines different stages starting from basic tracking of website data to advanced data driven decision making. The maturity model is a formal description of essential dimension and their competency levels of business practice. Collectively, these dimensions and levels define the maturity level of an organization. For example, a small online retailer initially relies on guesswork to decide which product to stock. As the business matures, it implements a data-driven approach by analyzing customer purchase trends, setting up automated inventory management system and optimizing stock levels based on predictive analysis. One more example, a simple business analytics maturity model moving from simple descriptive measure to predicting future outcomes to obtain a more sophisticated decision systems. So for web analytics, the most comprehensive model was proposed by Stephen Hamel. Now, this is the framework for web analytics maturity model, web analytics maturity model, which are which was introduced by Stephen Hamel. It used six dimensions and for each dimension, he used six levels of expertise. So these are the first six dimensions, management, objective, scope, resources, methodology and tools. So these are the six dimensions and for each dimension there are six levels of expertise starting from 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So we have here also 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So on each axis we have six levels of expertise or capability. So we have six dimensions and six levels. So just now we have discussed about six dimensions. Now let us discuss about the six levels starting from zero which is analytically impaired to five which is analytically competitor so we have here 0 0 is impaired 1 1 is initiated 2 2 is operational 3 3 is integrated 4 is competitor and 5 is addicted so these are the 6 levels from 0 to 5 So first let us discuss about the six dimensions starting from management. So management, it refers to the leadership's involvement in web analytics initiatives and their ability to create a data driven culture. Next objectives, it is the clarity of goals and objectives tied to analytics effort Next, scope. Scope refers to the range and extent of web analytics implementation within an organization. Next, resources. The availability of skilled person and financial investment. Next one, methodology. The process and 
framework used for analyzing and interpreting data and the last one is tools the platform and the technologies used for analytics so these are the six dimensions now next the six levels are indication of analytical maturity ranging from 0 which is analytically impaired to 5 which is analytically analytical competitor so let us discuss about this first one is 0 which is impaired organization at this level have little or no web analytics in place resulting in limited or inaccurate data collection then initiated basic analytic tools are set up and some data is collected but there is little analysis or action taken based on it next operational web analytics are regularly used with a focus on tracking key metrics and reporting and some insights are used to improve decision making next one integrated web analytics are integrated across the multiple channels and data is used holistically to optimize business strategy and customer experience next to competitor the organization uses analytics to benchmark performance against competitors making data driven decision to gain a competitive edge and the last one is addicted the analytics now are deeply embedded in every aspect of the business with constant optimization real time data use and a culture of data driven decision making next let us consider an example of web analytics maturity level for the last dimension which is tools so first zero zero means impaired that is no web analytic tools is tool is used next one means initiated basic tracking basic tracking tools are implemented for measuring simple metrics like page views and visitors next two operational web analytic tools are in regular use reports are generated to inform decision so insights may still be limited next integrated data from multiple platforms like website social media is integrated providing a comprehensive view of user behavior across various channels next competitor web analytic tools are used to benchmark against competitors and organization uses comparative data to gain a competitive advantage by analyzing competitors strategies next one addicted web analytic tools are deeply embedded into the business strategy with continuous optimization and real time decision making next topic is web analytics tools there are plenty of web analytics applications in the market the following are among the most popular free or almost free web analytics tools they are google web analytics yahoo web analytics open web analytics firestat site meter aw stats let us discuss all these one by one first one google web analytics this is a service offered by google that generates detailed statistics about a website's traffic and traffic sources and measures conversions and sales next one yahoo web analytics it is yahoo's alternative to dominant google analytics it is a comprehensive web analytic tool it has graph custom designed reports and real time data tracking next one open web analytics it is a popular open source web analytics software that anyone can use to track and analyze how people use websites and applications next one firestat it is a simple and straightforward web analytics application 
written in PHP MySQL. It supports numerous platforms and setups including Django sites. Next one, SiteMeter. It is a service that provides counter and tracking information for websites. It uses JavaScript or HTML to track visitor information. SiteMeter provides website owners with information about their visitors including how they reach the site, the date and time of their visit. Next, AW Stat. It is open source web analytics reporting tool suitable for analyzing data from internet services such as web, streaming media, mail. AW Stat parses and analyzes server log files producing HTML reports. Thank you.